Hey there friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Good morning everyone, welcome back to a brand new weekly vlog. So it is actually Saturday today and I've not vlogged all week. I do apologise, but I just wasn't feeling it. I did nothing interesting. So I just thought I would start the vlog today or now and then I'll probably like bring merge two weeks together um, to one bigger, bigger vlog. Um, yeah, it's Saturday, as I said, Saturday the 2nd I think. Saturday the 2nd of March, we're now into the 3rd month of 2019. I don't know what's happening, I've just had a bit of an accident where I picked my camera up, turned it on and accidentally dropped it on the floor. So I've just like spent 5 minutes making sure that it's okay and putting it back together. But seems all right um so today it's now 10 to 12 i've been chilling this morning i had a lion because the last few weekends have been really busy and i've not been able to have lions because our trains aren't running so i'm having to get like a bus and then a train that's taking everything is taking like 10 times longer so i'm not being able to like have lions and um, so i had a really nice line this morning i'm now just about to go to the park to take some pictures of my outfit because i want to and then I'm going to go to the post office and then to the bus stop because I'm going into the Central to get my nails sorted. So a couple of weeks ago I got my nails done at Wa Wa in, um, let me show you the other hand. Um, this hand's a bit better. Because um, the other one, the other hand I had a bit of a fight with um, the top player box and the top player box one and two of my nails broke. Um, these are my actual nails and um, I never let my nails go this long but they did them gel rather than polish so I can't get it off myself. Um, so I'm going to get it taken off and my nails redone, you know, treat myself and I'm going to go get some lunch. I also need to go to Primark to look at the suitcases. Um, and I'm just going to have a wander around Central. Um, I'm kind of really fun. Last time I went, I walked past Oaxaca. I'm really fancying Mexican. I've not had Mexican in a really long time. Um, and I've also, just want to talk about this, been, I'm going to sit down. The line's not as good here, but I'm going to sit down. So I've been listening non-stop this week to the new Busted album. And oh my word, it's spectacular. I absolutely flipping love it. Um, so if you've not heard it, go and listen. It's flipping good. Um, I would highly recommend um, I'm also wearing really, really light wash jeans today. I'm not sure how I feel about it, but I'll figure it out. Um, but I'm going to put some shoes on, pull myself in my bag and get going so I can go to the park and take some pictures. And then I can go to the post office and then get the bus and, you know, all that good. forgot to film while I was getting my nails done so I'll see if I can I have to show you tomorrow yeah the line's not very good but it's basically like a peach pink peachy base with pink and then lilac stars but I'll show you better tomorrow because the line's not very good because it's now five past six but I also picked up some bits from Primark while I was out I went to um went to a hacker for lunch which I filmed which was amazing I absolutely love hacker um so so good um but yeah, I got some bits in Primark, so I thought I would show you guys what I got. Um, the first thing is going to be a bit difficult to show, but it's this suitcase. And um, this was £25, um, and it's a like a hand luggage suitcase. Not much more I can say about that, really. Um, luckily, the lady on the till was really smart. I was like, do you want me to put all of your stuff in the suitcase? I was like, yes, I do. I then got a... Um, phone charging cable because my phone charger well my phone is dying but I'm pretty sure my phone charger is dying as well so got a new one of those which is two meters so it's extra long um, and then I got some bits for my holiday which is in like three four weeks time and I got some sunglasses look at eye sunglasses which were three pounds um, I then got um, I've got to try all of this on, but I then got a like a, can a candy cane, sort of coloured swimming costume. Um, it's more in real life, it's more green, whereas on camera it's more blue, um, like green and pink. Um, I then got a matching bikini, um, strapless bikini, so that um, I, I can try try not to get tan lines, which is just like, um, and then yeah, like blue 
some pink and yellow flowers and then I got some shorts for just like by the pool um just these blue and white striped shorts um really simple and then I got this top which I thought was could be would, would be nice for holiday but also just in general now I actually saw this in white and really wanted it in white but it must be super popular because it only got size 16 and size 14 so I got this and then just this like black um roughly sort of top and yeah that is what I got from Primark because I'm going to try all these bits on I'm going to get a cup of tea and chill and I'm probably I'll probably see you guys tomorrow because well tomorrow I've got nothing planned all I'm going to do is film some YouTube videos so that's my plan but I will rem try and remember to show you guys my nails because you really cannot see because the lighting is not great and you know it's starting to go dark so I'll try and remember to do that Hi everyone, so it's Sunday today, it's currently, it's quarter to four and I've just got back so I spent my, I'm going to move you around a bit, so I spent my morning filming three YouTube videos, I've edited one, I need to insert some pictures and just, you know, hoover my bedroom floor, did that sort of thing and then this afternoon I got the bus into Ilford which is like our nearest big, bigger town um, that had got a Primark to take the top back, that, um, the top back that I got in Primark yesterday so it was the black ruffle one just did not look right so I took that back and then I ended up popping into the pound shop so I thought I would show you what I got so I got two pots of pick and mix because it's a pound it was a pound and one was just too small and then so at work I in, got introduced this thing of <sighs> chocolate covered digestives dipped in cups of tea literally it's like changed my life honestly changed my life and the best things ever so i just so i got myself a twin pack of chocolate covered digestives from the pound shop feeling very proud of myself so i'm gonna go and get a cup of tea and put some put my leggings on leave this top but put my leggings on i'm gonna edit some finish editing the youtube videos upload today's youtube video and try and edit and schedule the other two and i'm gonna try and start watching some Umbrella Academy because I started that last week, no, two weeks ago, I think. But it's the sort of show where you actually need to be paying attention. So I've been watching so, a crazy amount of RuPaul's Drag Race lately. It's really good to just have them in the background, but I really want to get... It's really windy. <laughs> but I really want to get into Umbrella Academy Pilots Maze and I also really want to read the comic book, so I might have a look on Amazon how much it is. Um, so yeah, that's my agenda for the afternoon with my picking mix and my chocolate covered digestives and I am just gonna chill and get on with things literally getting up so I had a lie and I think I got up in the end at about like nine but honestly like not getting up at one o'clock in the afternoon you end up getting so much done it feels like it should be about eight o'clock but it's quarter to four my brain is like yeah, and I remembered I would said I would show you my nails. So I'm going to stand up here because it's a bit easier. So I can get them to focus. So you can kind of see. So every other fingernail. So it's like a peach base. And then these fingernails are pink stars. And these ones are lilac. But you can't really see them. Right? You can see on my hand. Yeah, that's what they are. You can kind of see. But yeah, this one with finger is my favourite. Very happy with them. Super cute, very different than what I had last time. And now I'm gonna take my boots off because my feet really hurt. Just... Hi everyone, so it's Monday. I've just got back from work and I just wanted to show you something that I picked up on my way home from work, which is the Umbrella Academy graphic novel. I don't know if I talked about this in the vlog earlier this week or if I just thought about it. Thought about talking about it or if I did, but um, the Umbrella Academy is just started as a new series on Netflix. I watched the first two episodes, really enjoyed it, but then realised it was a comic book and was like, I want to read the comic book first. So I attempted to buy it on Amazon and it was like, oh, it'll be dispatched within two to five weeks. So I was like, what the flip? So I tried to buy it on Waterstones and on Waterstones it was like, oh, being reprinted by a publisher. So you couldn't order online. However, you could do click and collect so you could find like your nearest store um, that had it in. So I went to them 
went for a little walk after work for a 10 minute walk, wasn't far, and picked it up. I'm super excited, I love comic books. If you've watched my channel for a while, you'll know. I really greatly enjoy them. Um, and yeah, I'm looking forward to reading this. Might start it tonight. Um, it's meant to be really, really good. Um, so yeah, very excited about this. As I say, it's Monday night. I'm not feeling great. Um, really a bit low, so I'm thinking I might order a cheeky delivery and um, around here it's not very good places so i'm thinking i might either do mcdonald's or kfc and just like screw it because why not and i'm gonna watch some repaul i've been really into repaul lately like i've just started season well i'm about halfway through season six and i'm really not enjoying season six i started on season four um so i'm thinking i might start a fresh season and see if i can get on with that better um so yeah i'm gonna put some comfy clothes on check out Deliveroo, maybe start reading this and try and cheer myself up a little bit. Good morning everyone, so it's, I think it's Saturday, it's Saturday, it's Saturday today, Saturday the 9th of March and I cannot remember the last time that I vlogged, please excuse if the light keeps getting funny, the sun keeps going behind the clouds and out from the clouds. Um. But yeah, I can't remember the last time that I vlogged. I think it might have been Monday, but I'm not sure. Um, I just wanted to say hi. Um, I don't think you've had the done merging for two weeks together for this vlog. Um, but I just wanted to show you, I'm just going to a more comfortable position, some things that arrived yesterday. So my, one of my favourite of all time illustrators is a lady called Ella Masters. And I've got a print from her here here and then i've got about like six or seven at home so the only artwork i've got with me is a5 or smaller and then there's photographs but i have so much art at home um and she was doing a sale and um so basically ella's brother passed away he committed suicide about a year ago and following that she started a project in a little um i think it's like a5 or a6 notebook and every day she's done like an illustration, just different things every day. Um, I'll link her Instagram in her Instagram and her shop in the description box. Um, and she has been selling some of she's like scanned some of them in and has been selling them on her website. And um, there's loads of different ones, loads of different vibes, and I picked some of them up. I got three, three um, ones that are lands landscape. No, portrait, portrait, um, three different ones, there's loads, and honestly, she's one of my favourite illustrators of all time, I've got so, uh, so, I've got so much by her, um, I've even got, I got for my dad for Christmas, not this Christmas, the Christmas before, a, a, like, a, um, commission one, like, she's amazing, she's been through a lot in her work, but her work really reflects that in a really beautiful way, um, so I picked up three of my favourites of her postcards, so this one says, never, never lose your role, which I really like, um, and it's also got on the back just Ella Masters with another tiger. I really liked that, and I really liked the sort of vibe behind it. I then picked up this bright yellow one um, with pink flowers and a little blue snake, um, which I thought was really pretty. And then this sort of more fashiony one, um, I'd seen this on her Instagram and absolutely loved it. So I picked those three little postcards up, so I'm going to put them on my wall somewhere not quite sure where and then it also came with this little like business card which is super cute so i'm probably going to put that somewhere as well um so i just wanted to show you those and i'll link her instagram and her blog in not her blog and her shop in the description box because i absolutely love ella like her her work is, inc is incredible she's so fucking talented she deserves so much so many more followers and so much more like recognition than than she gets um, as I say, I've got so much of her stuff, especially at home with like bigger pieces. Um, so the weather's so strange today. Um, but today, I said it's Saturday. This evening, I'm going out. On Saturday evening, who have I become? Um, as we're having our next London Lonely Girls Club meetup, we're going for dinner and for drinks um, at Meet Mission in Hoxton. Um, and then potentially somewhere else for drinks. We're gonna see what the vibe is. So that's this evening. Today I'm gonna go. I was gonna walk to Tesco, but the weather is a little bit like funny, so I'm not quite sure how I'm gonna if I'm gonna do that. But I need to have a shower and wash my hair. Um, 
I also need to film tomorrow's YouTube video, so thankfully it's got a bit nicer out, so that shouldn't be as much of a problem. Um, and yeah, that's today. Then tomorrow my dad is coming down to visit, and we are going to book a holiday, which is very exciting. But I'm going to stop rambling. I think I'm going to start. I haven't started yet, so I'm going to start editing this vlog. So I've got an idea of how long it even is. And I shall see you guys in a little bit. So it's a bit later. I've dried my hair, straightened my hair, and just about to put my makeup on. I've been having a whale of a time listening to the musical hits playlist on Spotify. The Great Showman, Mamma Mia. I'm having a great time. Okay, this back bit needs a bit straightening. Um, and yeah, I've just been I've been trying to sort my phone out because I've got like 2,000 pages on my phone, and like the majority of them are screenshots of quotes and tattoos. So I'm currently going through or attempting to go through my phone and get rid of anything I don't want, like, need, etc, etc. So I'm just going to put some makeup on to film a YouTube video to edit that needs to go up tomorrow, WWE pay per view predictions. And then I'm actually a bit hungry so I might go and get a cup of tea. Yeah, I'm just going away all the time. Waterloo for Mom and Mia too with Hugh Skinner and Ella James is like an absolute Hello, so it's now like 20 past 2. I was meant to be getting ready, like putting makeup on, so that I could film this video. But I went to get a cup of tea, which I now have, and I've been watching YouTube videos um, and dipping my chocolate covered digestives in my cup of tea. Oh my word, I'm like in heaven, honestly. Why did nobody, why did none of you tell me that chocolate covered digestives dipped in cups of tea is like absolute heaven? Like, there is, I don't think I've ever had anything like it that just makes me so happy. Like, this part of the vlog is so irrelevant and necessary, but I just wanted to talk about my new found love for chocolate covered digestives dipped in hot tea. Like, oh my word, it's so good. Like, it's my new comfort food. Like, oh my word, I'm in, I'm in love. <laughs> Um, I had to rethink my outfit because I was going to put on this red jacket that I got in a cell but it's more of a coat and I was just not feeling it so I put something else on. Um, last night was super fun, I think I only filmed the food um, but we had the most recent all the Little Girls Club last night, we had 12 of us which was amazing, so much fun, the food is amazing, we went to Meat Mission um, which is one of the meat liquors, um, it's in Hoxton in Shoreditch, super cool food as said was incredible um, and now I'm off to go and get the train to meet my dad so we, as my dad's coming down today we're going to the barbican, going to look around the conservatory, going to get some food, book holiday so it should be a nice day although the weather is like crazy it's so so windy um, but yeah I'm just about to leave I need to shove the rest of my stuff in my bag and then I will be off.
much later now and I'm just actually editing this week's weekly vlog um, and I realised I've not signed off or spoken in a while. Um, the last clip is me um, as a, is at the barbecue. I'm sorry about the noise, I'm going to try and speak up because it's chucking it down outside so the rain sounds really noisy on my windows. But I'm going to end this week's weekly vlog here. I got home quite a while ago, me and my dad went to the barbecue and we went to the, one of the, they've got like three or four cafes in there, I went to one of them called Bonfire, um, I had a burger, so that's like two burgers in 24 hours, oops, that's part of me, I know, but it's the weekend, and then we booked a holiday, which I'll probably tell you guys about a bit further down the line, um, we're going away in September. And then we looked around the conservatory, we got a cup of tea, and then we both went home. Um, I read my book on the way home, loving my book. Um, I'm literally re getting through this quite fast, so I think a video about that will be up very, very soon. Um, I hope you enjoyed this week's weekly vlog. Any links of anything will be in the description box, and if I've forgotten to link anything and you want to know, just hit me up in the comments and I'll try and remember, try and find the link to what you're after. Hope you have a fantastic day and shall see you guys very, very soon. Bye.